Welcome back everyone to Let's Play The Tales of Werewolves. Now, we have a new thingy, a new tramp, if you like. Uh, the Wayside Cross, if you remember from the last part, which does AoE damage, holy damage to, uh, well, I guess, uh, do, 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 immune creatures. Wolf, Grand Wolf, Macon Warrior, Macon Shaman, Windigo. Oh, great, Windigo, I guess. Alright. We can now go to Mashtyorgichach. The Indian village. As you can see, I'm very good at pronouncing Indian names. Chief Usimashk Steepy. Let's go here. What we can do here? I'm not sure. Oh, so. I sell silver bullets. Is that the same? I don't know. This is horrible. This talisman made from three bare teeth substantially increases the stamina of its aware. Wow, that is good. Made from a wolf tooth mounted on an onyx stone, this talisman creates a threatening aura around the wearer capable of frightening most animals. Plus 10 fear factor permanent. That is not bad at all. What was this? It's said to allow its wearer to change the wind direction at will. Ah, right, that's, we do that in, in the thingy. Old pine axe, we don't need this one anymore. Can we sell this one? Uh, how do I sell it again? I forgot. This item has no value. Great. <laughs> Alright, well... Let's see. Silver hatchet. Ah, oh, it's a silver hatchet. Because the Makans, it said, are very resistant to non-silver weapons. But, see, this is not as good uh, as this. Not as good at all. I think I want this stamina, though. Fear Factor is nice as well, but I believe I can only have one of these at a time? I don't know. I presume. I need some silver bullets as well. Yeah. I might, I think. Well, I just have ten, why not? Return to the village. Anything else here? No, just that. This is nicely done, though. Look at this place. This really looks cool. Alright. <clears throat> Let's go to Wolves Vale, see if we can buy anything silver. Probably not. I think the Indian village is the silver specialization people, guys, whatever. Uh, we need. I don't know. Because the silver weapons don't seem to be as good. At least for now. And I don't know if you can actually change between axes mid-game. Sprint 25% longer. That's a nice uh, musket, but I've got no money for it. Need some more bullets, why not? Uh. Wow, this is a really silent musket. Look at the discretion. Range. This has got loads of damage though and nice reload. But no, I'm not gonna be buying this stuff yet. Let's go back. Let's have this fight. Shall we? Alright, so in the first. In the f first. Uh, five of them. Five Will of the Wisps. These guys are quite bad actually. Resistant to non holy. Okay, we do have a holy axe, so that's good. Ghost for firewalls, gonna be lured. Yeah, we know that. Uh, what else do we have? One Macon Shaman. Ah, and already in the first turn. Cannot be lured with bait. Okay. Hanging net, spike trap, firewall, sacred tree. Ah, right, they don't go t uh, through firewalls. Okay, these guys are coming here. This guy is going there, and this guy probably for the church, yeah. Jeez. That's a lot of them. Lovely music, as always. And another one. Okay. So these guys are all going over here. I need... Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. First... Skills. <clears throat> That's what we can get. 
Enhanced crafting, 50% more damage. Wow, that's not bad at all. 100% more damage when you fire from the top of a watchtower. Your bait is now poisoned. Uh, we already have that, right? Yep. Bonfire increases your fear factor. No, your firewalls now frighten the will of the wisps. See, I don't know. I think that means it just holds them there for a little bit. It does not actually stop them. I don't know. Maximum number of hit points. Rifle reloading speed. Wow, that's not bad. Permits the accumulation of the three rage points. You know, I think I'm gonna go for bloodthirst because I want the maximum number of hit points. But I'm gonna take this firewall. No, actually, I'm not. I'm not. 25% of your stamina points. Yeah, I'm gonna go for bloodthirst for now. This is not bad either, though. Let's go for this, and we'll see what we can do later. <coughs> Alright. Ah, right. Oh, we can equip both of the talismans. 10 stamina permanent. Active item. Do we have to... Ah, we could buy the other one as well. The fear one. May do that, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Because I don't want them all attacking at once. Uh, this one. Yes, please. Thank you. Goodbye. Return to your house. Inventory. Alright, there it is. One... Oh, that's the, never mind. That's the active one. Come on. There we go. <laughs> All right, now let's deal with this. Let's see if our firewall will actually block these guys. Uh, bonfire, no, this firewall. Let's see if this actually works. It does not. Okay, so just as I thought, it actually just probably, you know stops them for a little bit. Okay, I'll fight these guys first. I need to deal with this guy going over there. I need to stop him from going here. Like that. So he'll go all the way around. Yep. And I can't block off this. I can block off this though. So I get some more time. <coughs> Alright, that's much better, so we can actually get here and fight him, hopefully. Where's this guy going? All the way over here, that's fine. Um, Alright, then we have uh, these wolves, which are also coming to our house. No, I didn't want to do that. No way. This guy's going here. Wait, what is this? One Macon Shaman. Alright. Block off this. Where's he going now? All the way over here. Well, we're gonna block this off as well. Now he has to go all the way around and past us. Excellent. And then we have this guy. Oh, that's not good. We'll have to deal with this guy somehow. And rather quickly as well. Hmm. Well, I guess we can delay him so we have some time. Oh, he's still going there? Oh, we just didn't put it where we should have. Like so. That's a lot of time units, but I have to do it. Right, he has to go all the way around now. So that's good. Hopefully that will give me some time. Okay, do we have them all now? I, I do believe we have. Where's this guy going? Here. Okay. Wave number two. Oh, shit. There's a lot of them. This guy's going around. This guy's going here. Okay, I need some traps here. Like so. Uh, then we have this guy going here as well. This guy going here. 
This is gonna be... Yeah. I don't know, this is gonna be problematic. Wait, these guys are coming in wave number two as well? No, this is wave number one. I guess. Hopefully. Right, do we have the time... ...to use this hanging net on these guys? That would be pretty nice. But I don't know if we have the time. Okay, I think I'll just have to fight all of the other ones. <clears throat> How much is this? This is free. It's 35 action points. Watchtower... Bonfire. I think a bonfire would be quite useful here, really. I'll put this here. Why not? So it helps me against those things, hopefully. <laughs> right, let's chop down some trees. I think that's all we need for now, hopefully. Could place another tower from here to here, but I don't think we'll need that. Okay, I have no idea in what order we're gonna do that, because obviously I always forget in advance what my plan was. You have to equip the Egg of Metro. I have to equip it. Ah. Oh. For X1 HP per hit. Oh, like this? Ah, excellent, excellent. Old Pine X. Right. Let's see. I think if I, if I put the other axe in my inventory, I can switch between them. I'm not sure. Might be. This is gonna be bad. Right, this is gonna be bad. Okay. Ooh. We asked you to leave, and you are still here. Why? We're not budging. Our sister's sick. We can't leave her here. This is your last chance. Leave or die. This is your last chance, too. You leave here on your own steam, or else I'll return you to your mother in a little package of ground meat tied up with a tail. <laughs> What's your choice, friend? Yeah. Okay. Oh. The Egg of Metshu. You now possess a very powerful magical artifact that allows you to control the direction of wind itself. The Egg of Metshu. To use the amulet, simply use the item from your pack by pressing the corresponding number. Use your mouse to orient the wind in whatever direction you wish. <laughs> Once the wind is in its desired direction, simply move your hero to break your control over it. Ah, so we can actually get them all to get to go to us. That's pretty cool. Well, let's see if we can uh, get these fire guys here. Okay, they're about to come. Ah, so I didn't actually need to place all those firewalls and everything. Oh, okay. One, three, no! Yes! Come on, get here. There we go. Oh, that's not good. Yeah! Rage! The game is lagging a little bit for some reason. Okay, that was quick. Wow. What? Wave number two? That was just the first wave? Ah, oh, why? I thought the game was giving us... Uh, never mind. I thought the first wave comprised of all of those things that we've seen. And it doesn't. So now... Oh, damn. Okay, let's, let's try this. Let's get all these guys to us. Yeah. This is pretty cool. There they go. Where are they? There they are. Actually, hold on. Yeah, fire. Come on, boys. <laughs> Headshot. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, what the hell was that? That was magic. Resisted. Ow, ow, ow. That's that's not good. Let's get back to the fire for now. Whoa. 
Increase your damage by selecting the proper bullet type. Okay. No, don't want that. This guy does not like us at all. Okay, we need rage. Rage attack now. Come on. That's not good. Nope. Yeah, let's, let's use the scream to get our uh, to get our fear factor up. Oh, this is not good. No, you don't. Rage attack. Ow! But this guy is enraged as well. I need eau de vie. I don't. Will that guy stop raging or not? Damn. Ow. Oh, he's he's healing. Did you see that? He's healing. No, you don't. And I'm out of stamina. Come on. Ow. God damn. Stop it. Rage attack! Oh, he's enraging them and healing them. What's going on? Right, I need silver bullets. Ow! That's not good. And now they're attacking the church. This is not gonna be good. This is not gonna be good. I'm wasting too much time with these. How do I kill them? And I missed that. Come on, let's kill this guy, come on! The church is gonna get destroyed! Oh, Pete's sake! Yes, I know. And once again... Oh, come on. Yeah, the church is gonna get destroyed, I know. But this is... this is... <sighs> okay, fine. For some reason, the game is showing me all the bloody waves instead of just one wave. While I don't, you will be in the morning before you set traps, bought items, or acquired any skills. Keeping all your traps, items, and skills, just if you don't want to make major changes to your strategy. Okay, I want that. Twilight. And then we'll change a couple of the traps. Jeez, these are bloody annoying. They can heal. That's really, really bloody annoying. And apparently I really need a silver weapon. If you keep failing a night over and over again, it might be a better idea to restart at dawn rather than at twilight, since this option doesn't refund the action points you might have used to chop lumber. Okay. So why in the hell... Look. Okay. Right, okay, fine. Alright. I don't actually need this. I don't need it. I can just use this and then somehow you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna kill this guy first in wave 2 and then go back to the house and try to kill the rest and I will use this as well I will use this so they can get near the fire, and hopefully I can get some damage on them. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Move to... I'm gonna zip line to that tower here. I could shoot from the tower as well, but... Yeah. 
And apparently I definitely need a silver weapon. Damn. Let's see. I guess this silver uh, axe will make a big difference then. Uh, it's actually not that much less damage. It's very... Uh, it's not that good though. But I guess I need it. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, return to your house. Chop down trees. Come on. Okay. Inventory. Uh, old pine axe. Yeah, this one. Can I put it? No, I can't. Great. Well, I'll just need to change it then, I guess. I don't know if this will work. <coughs> but let's try anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. Start night. Let's see how this works. <coughs> okay, we've already seen the... Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> That's a big trap. I uh, see that was a bit confusing though. Yeah, we know about that. We know. The egg, the egg of Matashu. Right, let's go here. Actually, I could do this. I could shout here. When they all appear. Ah! Attack me, go, darn it! Okay, and if they all gather over there, that won't. That wasn't too good. Ow. Jeez, come on. And now he went underground to heal up. That's annoying. Well, this is already not good. That guy's going underground. This is not working! Come on. Wait! Get up! Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is annoying! I guess I need that bloody cross or whatever. Okay, you know what? Get on this bloody trap. Jeff, come on. Get on this bloody trap here. Oh, it doesn't work on them, of course. I forgot. Please kill them. Oh, come on. This axe sucks. You're too exhausted. <sighs> and they just keep going underground and healing, for fuck's sake. Okay, I need that bloody fucking stupid holy cross or whatever. This axe sucks, but I need them for the bloody makings. <sighs> okay. Frustrating part all of a sudden. Not enjoyable at all. Alright, well, let's try this again. Bloody hell. Okay, fine. Let's move the damn map. Uh, I need a bloody cross here. Something like that. Okay, and I need to get the bloody trap to work. Right. Let's try this again. Oh, I didn't buy the silver axe, did I? Uh, yes, I did. Okay, silver hatchet. Completely useless. I guess I should bless it as well, but it costs one dollar. I'm gonna try it without it. If you feel like you need a little extra help planning your strategy for the coming night, simply click on the strategy hints. Not yet. I start night. Right, we're gonna kill these bastards now. And if not, then we're gonna go mental. <clears throat> yeah, don't give me the tutorial again, I know it. 
I know. Yes, yes, yes. Alright. Let's go to this bloody place. Come on. I wish there was some way to change the FOV because it's really bloody annoying. Alright, okay. Hopefully we'll get a three here. One, two, well, two, I guess, will work. Kill a will with a wrist, only using the bat. Okay, see that works much better now. And it's actually afraid of us. Oh, there's one more. Don't you go underground, you little bastard. Alright, okay. Now. Let's go to this bloody tower. Oh, I should have... Oh, no! I've forgotten to take the fire out. Oh, no, I didn't. Wait, why did I go here? That's not right. No, not this one. Oh, something happened. Where is he? There he is. Come on! Alright, let's kill this one. Ah, oh, should have used that. Okay, I can take this one. Just keep it on the ground. See? Like that. Alright, let's go back quickly. Oh, they're already attacking the house. It's not good. I'm coming! Come on! What? It's already been destroyed! Oh, why did I why did I use the fire? Shouldn't have done that. Oh no 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 no! I need to use this. Come on. Use the bloody. Ah, oh, I move. See, I use the amulet to change the direction of the wind, but I moved at the same time. Which tower do I need to go to? This one, right? Oh, this isn't good. I'm completely confused now. The, the game is a bit confusing, but for some reason this is much more manageable now. Where are the... Where is he? There he is. Oh, that's that annoying guy. Ow. Right, if I can keep it on the floor, I can kill him. There we go. Where's the rest? I think he's closer to... Yeah, he's over there. I need to go to that last... To the mill, I believe. Yep. Need to get to the mill. Okay, this was <laughs> unexpected, but uh, manageable, I guess. I didn't fight them all at once. That was really the big deal here. I actually put a silver one in. Where were you? I'm just gonna go down and kill him. See, if there's only one, you can keep it. Oh. I wanted to say you can keep him on the ground, like this. Is there more? Phew. Yeah. That was not easy. Well, I guess it was just a change of strategy, but still, bloody hell. If you get a lot of these makers together, they just keep healing and healing. Really annoying. Only got a dollar and a half. Alright. 
Owner of a very prosperous woodworking company, Napoleon has been mayor of Wolveswell ever since it was founded. While known for his rather unorthodox persuasion techniques, he is more feared than respected by the people of the village, which forces him to be constantly on the lookout, employing many spies to keep track of potential plots against him. Nevertheless, as the mayor, he still manages to stay very proud of his village, which he, see, uh, he is ready to defend tooth and nail against any danger from outside. Right. So... Terrors and hope. Father, forgive me for I have sinned. I'm listening. Speak freely. <laughs> I don't know what's happening in the village, but it's if, well, as if we're all going crazy. I have dreams at night where I'm acting like a bloodthirsty animal. Go on. I have longings for red meat and ideas about. I'm ashamed. If only you knew how ashamed I am. Lecherous ideas. And not only with my wife, but with all the women in the village. I know what's happening to you. It's the fault of my former servant, Josephine. She's a witch. I always knew there was something fishy about that girl. Say two Hail Marys and the Our Father. Evil lies in wait. May God bless you. Amen. That's not gonna work. We need axes and fire and bullets. Bravo. That was a lie worthy of a pope, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> These guys are pretty cool. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.